with this labour, there will be a concern there that it'll go the, the same way as my first and second did. Well, I, I will be rushed down to theatre. But I think I'm just too strong-willed to lie down and accept that. Here you go. You keep that. <clears throat> Are you allergic to anything, Chris? No. Nope. Mm. Oh, yeah, two, tea. Okay. Tea. Yeah. No, that's an A. That's what you get called tea. So oh, Chris. tea. So I think that's what you're signaling to me. I thought you were saying you're allergic to, to, to tea. <laughs> <laughs> I think you can't have one of them just yet. Tina's always polite. I can't stand being called Chris. Sorry, Sorry Angel. Sorry. She'll let people know in a polite way what she wants. Just tea. Tea or Tina, yeah, but not Chris. But then if she doesn't get it, she'll let them know in a more direct way. Right, let me pop these it around your belly. It doesn't piss me off. <sighs> she definitely knows her own mind and she lets other people know that she's got an opinion as well. I mean, if you got a drink, um, there's lots of, like, different fruit juices. Will you get one out, please? Um, I'll tell you what, in the brown bag, it's in one of the smaller pockets. Are you allowed pineapple? I don't know. I'm the boss in the relationship. And I like to think she's the boss <laughs> in the relationship. Right, so what are you thinking, Tate? Do you want to stay with the gas for a little while? No. Or do you want something extra? I can't remember what to what, to be honest. Just something that bloody works. Well, the, the, the thing that's going to work straight away for you is an injection of diamorphine. That takes yeah, about ten then. minutes to work. Mm -hmm. Are you wanting to stay away from an epidural? or you're thinking, I don't want epidural. As, don't want as long as... I, I mean, I've had epidural with the previous two. I just associate it with the section. Pregnancy-wise, I've had two previous emergency sections. How far did you get in your other labours? Two previous labours have lasted around the 24-hour mark. Finley, first, uh, she only got to about four and a half and Not was named. in distress. First baby was about four and a half fetal distress. Second baby got to about nine centimetres and then I didn't progress, but the baby was still OK. She doesn't know the baby's Yeah, what, you, what she said anyway, yeah. Yeah. With this labour, there will be a concern there that it'll go the, the same way as my first and second did. Well, I will be rushed down to theatre. But I think I'm just too strong-willed to lie down and accept that. Um, Alan's concerned that I can't have pineapple juice to add in labour. It's OK, isn't it? It's perfectly fine, yeah. Don't worry, you can sip on that. What I'm going to say, hon, is just not to have anything to eat, OK? Just because of the history and, obviously, yeah. the more increased risk that you are, you would end up in theatre again. I'm sure you're not going to. I'm not. <laughs> but um, I don't want you to have a full stomach if that was going to happen. I'm taking it as a challenge just to prove that I can have a natural labour. I think it's just a woman thing. I, it's my natural right. I bet you've been doing everything you can to get into labour naturally, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. Tried all... Is that why you're on the pineapple juice? Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> I can't. I don't think I can. OK. It's only ready when it's ready. OK. Oh. I still don't know whether I want to go bottom end or not. I just tail the top end. This is your very last chance to actually see your baby come out. I'm moving on to be a younger model. Pardon? I'm going to move on to a young one. <laughs> it's, it's a good job she's drugged up, Alan. <laughs> <laughs> I just say I'm too old. Yeah. True. My consultant suggested this time round I should have a planned cesarean. Who younger than me is going to want to go with you? It's not one with for me money. Your money? <laughs> but I don't want. Eight other people around me having to deliver the baby for me. I, I want to be able to, you know, me, Alan, and a midwife passing me the baby. <laughs> You're right. He's fine. Mm. The only reason I'm doing this to get the trace is just because I'm all fours. It's really hard to keep the hold yeah. of the baby's heart rate, that's all. With our second labour, I was nine plus centimetres, but I was fine, baby was fine, and they still decided to take me down 
If I think this time round, I will question them more. It's really worried me that he's pooed. It does worry me slightly that Tina is that set on having a natural birth, that it, it could come into play with medical advice and whether she'll go against it. What are you, uh, how many days over are you? Five. And it does worry me slightly that I might have to be the one to say to Tina, stop and, and listen to the advice. Once they get to 40 weeks, they just mature, the body's let go of the poo that's inside them. Right, okay. Doesn't mean there's any distress. Right, that's what I was worried about, though. Is, that that sometimes it does, I'm not going to lie to you, sometimes it does, but your baby's not, OK? Right, okay just, fine. you know, half, half of them poo. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I can't imagine that I'd go too far against medical advice. But I also know I'm stubborn, you know? Yeah, I am quite stubborn. <laughs> You'd be able to tell by the heartbeat rate in that, wouldn't you? Exactly, yeah. If you were to tell me off, though, I think that'd be it, because you don't tell anybody <laughs> off. Baby's this far away. Just, if you get that urge, go with it, OK? okay. Right. Everything's looking right? really promising. Yeah, absolutely fine. So is she, like, fully dilating now? Or is she... Almost, but cos she's pushing with each one, it's just going and going and yeah, going. Yeah. <sighs> we're doing it. Well, not we, you. I'm just here. Go on, Angel. Go on. Go for it. Go on. Go on. Let's have this head. It will be at the forefront of my mind. It's going to be our last, our last baby. Go on. Good girl. So it's my, it is my last chance to be able to have a natural birth. I'm just so happy to be able to have it. I know you are. <sighs> you can see the head. Really? Yeah. You saw the head. <sighs> Got more hair than dad. It's not hard, is it? <laughs> the way this labour goes, if it doesn't go the way I'd like it to, we may well have to have another. <laughs> well done, T. Go with it. Oh. Fantastic. Oh. That's the way. Brilliant. Oh. Good girl. Oh. Don't be scared, don't be scared. Oh. Oh. Blow, blow, blow. <laughs> Can Alan cut the cords? Is that okay? Yeah, I'm not going to do it just yet. <laughs> okay. Let's turn him so you can see Dad. Obviously, with the previous two being cesareans, I've not had the chance to cut the cord. I think that'll be the crowning moment of knowing I've done it. I've done it for me, and I've I've done it for you too. I still can't believe I did it. I'm so glad you got to do it, cos you were one of the ones that really wanted a normal yeah, delivery yeah. and not the section.